Hi Gemini, welcome to your reading. This is Feline Intuition Tarot. This is going to be for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Venus and Rising. Let's see what messages want to come out for you. What do we have for Gemini? What are the messages for Gemini? We got sipping, nosy, spreading rumors, gossiping, reading up, doing the research, learning more, gaining insights. Wine and dine, courtship, consistently dating, romance and passion, and you have time. Delay procrastination, too busy. Hmm. If you are currently dating, people are looking for information about your relationship. Well, they will be. What are the messages for Gemini? What are the messages for Gemini? Spiritual cleanse, real love, butterflies, heartfelt connection, relationship goals, power couple, marriage stability, which is granted romance, no question, no doubt, and you have soulmates, and you have obsession, someone constantly thinks about you, comparison, stalking, keeps photos and screenshots, this could be a partner, an ex, a family member, a friend, a foe, or a comic. It does seem like those people obsessed with your business, like your love life, what you got going on. But let's see, what, what are the messages for Gemini? What's the energy between Gemini and the person they're thinking about? What's the energy between Gemini and the person they're thinking about? Someone doesn't want to move on from you. They're very unhappy if you guys are not together. Ten of Cups in reverse. Six of Swords in reverse. You could either be rejecting that person or feeling rejected by them. Mutual energy. You're both pushing each other away and you both have your guard up, but you're both emotional about each other. Okay. Hmm. Near future. And then that for some of you, there's some rich person going to be offering you love, but you don't want it. You want a specific person. For others of you, it is your person offering you love. I do see that there is someone who doesn't want to move on from you. But for a small amount of you, I got a message of um, a person that you don't want. Maybe they're financially stable, but you're not interested in them like that. But when it comes to someone you are interested in, it's like you don't know that they're actually wanting to come back. But they feel like you have your guard up. There could be some kind of misunderstanding when it comes to communication. I do see you guys communicating better in the near future. Could be a Leo for some of you, could be a Taurus. Let's look at your main spread. Okay, what are the messages for Gemini? What are the messages for Gemini? Messages for Gemini. Yeah, it seems like you're under the impression that this person is done with you, but they actually don't want to move on from you. They're actually very sad about the situation. They feel like you're rejecting them. Maybe you are. If you're not rejecting them and you do want them, they think that, um, well, if you're not rejecting them and you want them, you think that they're rejecting you, but they're actually not. It could be a Pisces or a Scorpio. I literally have um, the water signs. All three water signs. They could be a water sign or have water in their chart. 
you definitely um, either you either you're rejecting this person or you don't know that they're actually like not wanting to move on from you. Okay. Ten of Swords. Yeah, they do feel like really sad about the situation and they they feel like you're getting over them so it could be that that you don't want them for the gemini's that do want this person they do want you also you just don't really know it yet the cards are saying it and they don't want to move on they could even be coming towards you very soon very very soon Because they feel like you're letting them go. My death card. Either you feel like... Either you feel like you're happy with them or you feel like you're happy without them. What? What's going on with the Two of Pentacles in reverse for Gemini? Yeah, some... <laughs> Gemini, what's going on? You are... letting a person go... Because you either want someone else. Some of you could have met someone else. And there's someone that you're walking away from and you want to be with someone. That's not for all of you. For others of you. Hmm. There is like some type of reconciliation happening with this person. But it's like... It's when you kind of like let them go because you think that they're done with you, but they're actually not. Why the Eight of Swords in reverse? Yeah, Two of Cups. There's something about someone in the situation not wanting the relationship to end. You got Six of Swords in reverse, Death in reverse, Two of Cups. Maybe they're not letting you know that they're not done with you. Because you got the moon in reverse there. Why the magician? They could be wanting to play hard to get. So for some of you, the reason why you don't know that this person is still stuck on you is because they don't want you to know that they're vulnerable. They want you to think that you don't, they want you to think that they don't want you. Which is just game playing. Ace of Swords reverse. Yeah, it's like they see you as rejecting them. So they're kind of um, rebelling or making it seem like they're not interested either. Very like miscommunication between you two. They think you don't want them. You think they don't want you. Eight of Wands. Some of you might walk away from them because you feel like they're too egotistical. And again, some of you might walk away from them and walk towards someone new that you commit to. King of Cups. 
So you could be walking away from an egotistical game player to someone who's more emotionally stable. That's for some of you, and it could happen very quickly with the Eight of Wands. Or they start playing games. They start acting like they're not interested, and you guys actually make up. Hmm. It does seem like there's a game play player, someone who wants you to think that they're not interested, but they are. They're actually very like sad about the situation. They think about it all day. Other messages for Gemini. Other messages. Opportunity, new routes ahead. Hex, a little bit of juju. It's kind of like the devil card, so like toxic behavior, control. Fear, fear is an illusion. Betrayal wants you back on your front. Death, rebirth, unfinished business, loose ends. Boundaries protecting your energy, self-care. Yeah, there's something about this person where they play games. They want you, but they don't want you to know that they want you. Which is manipulation. So I don't know if you're working on things with them or if you're going to be choosing someone else. This is just for Gemini. Love song, let love's melody inspire your dance together. Harmony, rhythm, in sync, free flights. Give one another space to grow individually. Release, breathe, clear. Ever after having fortitude to create a lasting love, long-term, all-in, invested. Needs tending, pay more attention to your love life to get results. Nourish, date, and respond. There's a game player involved, and I feel like there could be someone coming in or someone you already know who is more serious. Because you do have spiritual cleanse. And then you got real love and soulmate. So could it be that you're dealing with someone toxic and you're actually about to move towards someone more healthy? What's going on with the gossip? There could be gossip about your money. There could also be gossip about the fact that this person doesn't want to move on from you. Also the obsession card. Yeah, I feel like they're actually secretly obsessed, but they don't want you to know. They could be very childish with the fool. They could be younger than you for some of you and obsessed like they they some of you they don't know how to deal with their emotions could be a leo for some of you could have a lot of pride yeah could be immaturity and pride they will come towards you and want to offer you love but they're a game player is what i'm seeing Other messages for Gemini. Travel. Vacation, honeymoon, enjoyment. New love, new person, unknown person. Karma, toxic story, new opportunities. You got new opportunities twice. Well, opportunity, new roads ahead. So there could be a new person coming in. Childlike, innocent, fun children. This person could be younger than you and childish. The one who um, is playing games and acting like they don't want you. Union, serious relationship, marriage, partnership. 
twin flame spiritually spiritual alignment effortless karmic passion chemistry passionate feelings so that game player could um have to watch you move on to someone more mature and into a more serious relationship so it could be them gossiping as well and them stalking you being obsessed so they could be watching you dating someone new because you got consistently dating it seems like this person over here doesn't date consistently they play games and it's like you're gonna see how attached they are to you as you move on or as you distance yourself from them so gemini this is what i'm seeing for you they could be a scorpio for some of you they could be a leo there's a lot of leo energy all the water signs and capricorn and those are the main signs so i hope this was helpful thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one